a brother that perished. They have family. Outside of Dallas Executive Airport. Difficult moment as this. A memorial has grown for the six victims who died at the Dallas Air Show crash. I feel that they're brothers. Many in the aviation community across the country feeling the deep sadness. So it's like a connecting point where they come and download their, their emotions. This is retired American Airlines Captain Terry Barker, identified by Keller City officials. Always helping people, um, husband, dad, army veteran, um, and a, a retired pilot. The news hit hard for Kelly City Mayor Armin Mazzani. Terry has been someone who was a, a friend. Uh, he was uh, someone who I sought counsel for uh, when I got started. Mazzani says Barker was not only a longtime pilot with experience, but he served as a Keller City Counselor for three years. Just total shock uh, when you hear that because uh, Terry was someone that was around all the time. A sentiment retired American Airlines Captain J.P. Brooks also shares. I had heard there was a crash, but I didn't think... I didn't think it was them. The news hit hard for Brooks. I, my jaw hit the floor. He was friends with Barker and retired American Airlines captain Len Root, who also died. Len was uh, more matter of fact, less banter, but more of an engineering mind. Brooks just saw him at DFW Airport. His uh, iPad and equipment back to American Airlines to Turn in all his stuff after retirement. Family and friends of Major Curtis Rowe sharing their pain. Rowe was part of the Ohio wing of the Civil Air Patrol. And I feel emotional. And the pain felt in the Houston area, where friends tell us former United Airlines pilot Craig Hutain died doing what he loved. In Dallas, I'm Melanie Basu.